Chairman of the Tarawa State Council of Traditional Rulers, the Akuoka of Wukari, has emphasized that the local government autonomy granted by the Supreme Court will help restore the diminished status of traditional institutions nationwide. Our correspondent Jude Nuhugundele filed this report. The Abel Peter Dia led local government autonomy advisory committee is making its first official visit to southern Taraba State. The committee has come to the palace of the Akuoka of Wukari the chairman of the Taraba State Council of Traditional Rulers, to gather input on a workable template for implementing local government autonomy in the state. This will be submitted to Governor Agu Kafis. Speaking on behalf of the traditional rulers in southern Taraba, the Yakuuka described the committee's visit as timely and commended Governor Kafis for this initiative. And the issue is timely because the traditional council suffered a lot in the hand of the local government, the past local governments. We don't want such thing to happen again. I think that is why His Excellency decided to set up the committee to set in right. We are happy. We are coming. He promises that the traditional institution in the state will contribute positively to the success of the committee. We are going to give you the best of uh, what we know, that we guide you, and we will. And we pray that whatever we discuss will be implemented for the benefit of the local government and the traditional rulers. The chairman of the advisory committee, Abel Peter Dia, informs the traditional rulers in attendance that the purpose of the visit is to gather their input on how the autonomy can be implemented for the well-being of residents. He also acknowledges the role of traditional rulers. I recognize the apprehension and uncertainty that may be felt within our traditional institution. Let me assure you, our well fathers, that your rule and position within the fabric of our society remain as vital and as relevant as ever. The autonomy granted to local government does not in any way diminish your significance of all traditional authority and the deep-rooted connection you hold with your respective communities. It is our firm belief that the local government autonomy will serve to strengthen and empower our traditional institution, allowing you to play an ever more pivotal role in the development and well-being of our people. Other rulers share their views. Because of the passion that the governor has and respect on the traditional rulers, he set up this committee to, at the initial stage, come out with a blueprint to tackle and handle the smoothness of the relationship and the existence of how the new autonomous local government will be in Taraba State, and that is unique in the whole nation. It is hoped that the committee's recommendations to Governor Kafis on full implementation of local government autonomy in the state will be significantly informed by the contributions of traditional rulers. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.